We want to get a check of that forecast with meteorologist Carson Meredith. Yeah, he's in the Storm Tracker Weather Center with uh, hopefully news about more of this gorgeous weather yes. we're already enjoying. We're hey, smiling because it's positive. Yep. Yeah, this nice weather not going anywhere for the rest of the week. The weekend doesn't look too bad either, but for today in particular, we're on record watch. We're going to talk more about that here in a second. Let's show you what's happening as you get out the door. Temperatures a little cool, not too bad though. Most of us in the lower 40s right now. You see those crystal clear blue skies on the way 31 Skycam Network. Some of us are still in the 30s though, like Decatur where it's 38 degrees. But when all is said and done today, we are going to be in the upper 70s. We topped out around 76 yesterday. I think we're going to be in that same ballpark once again. But look how quickly those temperatures warm up this morning though. By noon, going to be in the lower 70s. A spectacular day to have lunch outside, any outdoor activities for that matter. And here's our record watch. Again, 77 is that forecast high. Although I will say, if you're in northwest Alabama, could be making a run for 80 this afternoon. We'll keep an eye on that. Our record here in Huntsville for March 3rd set back in 1983 when we hit 78. So that record is definitely in jeopardy. We'll keep an eye on those numbers in that thermometer throughout the day. We are dry on the way 31 storm tracker early warning radar network, and we will stay completely dry through Saturday. And as we look ahead to the weekend, though, there's some smaller chances back in the forecast for a few showers until then on future radar. Well, not a whole lot to talk about. Now this data source suggesting maybe the lower 70s for those high temperatures. But again, we talked about this yesterday morning with this type of weather pattern. When you have strong high pressure, crystal clear blue skies, a southerly wind, usually those temperatures overperform what that forecast guidance is suggesting. That's why our forecast is in the upper 70s today. When you wake up Friday morning, carbon copy of this morning, clear skies, temperatures a little cool, not too bad in the mid 40s. But tomorrow afternoon, you start to see some of that thin cloud cover move in. We're still going to have a decent bit of sunshine. It'll just be filtered sunshine for your Friday afternoon. And then that thicker cloud cover starts to move in late Friday night and last throughout the day on Saturday and into Sunday as well. There's those rain chances for your weekend. Again, it's not a whole lot. I think a lot of us will stay dry, but there will be that chance at least on the table for a few of those showers Sunday afternoon. That's thanks to a warm front that will set up just off to our north across Tennessee and into Kentucky as well. That's where the most widespread rain will be on Sunday. But we can have a few showers in our southern Tennessee tier as well as far northwestern Alabama as well. The main show with this next system it's going to be on Monday. There you see that cold front off to our west along Mississippi River Monday morning. It arrives here at home Monday afternoon. A lot of rain, a few embedded thunderstorms too. As far as the severe weather potential is concerned on Monday, we're not expecting any severe storms at this point, but with any storm this time of year, we could have some gusty winds, heavy rainfall, of course, but that severe weather risk for now is low. Of course, that could, could change over the next few days. And then that front moves through late Monday night and we'll start to dry things out looking ahead to next Tuesday. Going to see a around a half inch to one inch of rainfall over the next seven days. But by and large, all of this is going to fall on Monday. So we're not too worried about flooding at this point. Just a classic springtime cold front. But as you look at that seven day forecast until that cold front arrives on Monday, that's some pretty nice weather to talk about. 77 today, staying in the upper 70s through Sunday. And then once that front passes through early next week, we cool back down 57 on Tuesday and then in the 60s for the rest of next week.